The word sonnet is an Italian word, meaning little sound. It's now used for a small poem of 14 lines with a fixed rhyme scheme. It's originally a short poem recited to accompaniment of music. The word sonnet being a derivative of Italian sonetto, meaning a little sound or strain. The birthplace of sonnet has not been definitely determined. It's however first met within the Italy in later half of 13th century. It's particularly associated with name of greatest Italian poet Petrarch. The sonnets are of two types, Petrarchan sonnets, these are also called Italian sonnets, Shakespearean sonnets, these are also called English sonnets. English sonnet was introduced in the first half of the 16th century by Thomas Watt and Henry Howard. He was also known as Earl of Surrey. They completely discarded the Petrarchan form of sonnet. Shakespeare used this form of most vigorously like a master. That is why it is known as the Shakespearean sonnet. Shakespeare was writing in Elizabethan age. His themes in the sonnets are time and love. These are two persons to whom the sonnets are addressed. The first group of sonnets 1 to 126 are addressed to a male friend Earl of Southampton. While second group of sonnets 127 to 152 are addressed to Shakespeare's mistress who had come to be known as Dark Lady. Her name was Mary Fitton. Shakespeare loved both his male friend and his mistress. The two final sonnets, sonnet 153 and 154, focus on the classical god Cupid and playfully detail desire and longing. They do not seem to directly relate to the rest of the collection. Love for both of them was intense and passionate. Both of them betrayed and developed a sexual relationship with each other. His sonnets were published in 1603. Shakespeare began writing them in 1592.